This is breaking news. Country singer Caleb Kennedy, who competed in American Idol season 19, has been sentenced to eight years in prison following his involvement in a 2022 car crash that killed a man in Packlet, South Carolina. Kennedy pleaded guilty last week to the felony charge of driving under the influence resulting in death, according to the Greenville News. He was initially sentenced to 25 years in prison and a $25,100 fine. But he had that sentence and fine reduced to eight years and $15,100, with three of those years served in home detention. He also received credit for the nearly three years he has already served. Additionally, the singer will serve five years of probation and is required to attend mental health and substance abuse counseling. The legal update comes nearly three years after Kennedy, then 17, struck and killed 54-year-old Larry Dwayne Paris while driving his Ford F-150 on February 8, 2022. Warrants alleged that Kennedy was under the influence of marijuana at the time, and he was arrested on the DUI charge on the day of the crash. Ryan Beasley, Kennedy's attorney, told the news that the sentencing was fair. He's got no record, and he was a minor when this happened, Beasley said. This wasn't such an egregious act that you see most of the time, where people were drinking and driving then they hit somebody at night, or going the wrong way down the road. This was a weird reaction from his prescription medicine and possibly THC. Beasley also said that Kennedy is very remorseful, and that the sentencing starts the healing process for everybody involved in this situation. The news notes that Paris family wanted the maximum 25-year sentence. Kennedy made it to the top seven of American Idol season 19, but withdrew from the competition after a video of him standing next to a person wearing a Ku Klux Klan-style hood resurfaced. I was younger and did not think about the actions, but that's not an excuse, Kennedy said, in part, on social media at the time. I want to say I'm sorry to all my fans and everyone who I have let down.